Before this video starts, what the actual visual part of this video showcases is related to what I'm going to explain. If you don't like listening to big words, then I would recommend reading along with the script in the description so it is easier to understand. Oh, and also, please, please, please don't send hate to Tom and OCZ or anything like that. I am trying to help him improve his game so it is benefiting him and the community. Now, let's jump straight to the point. The reason I think competitive play would be close to basically ruined because of the new update is because of a feature in the game that was patched. Tomino CZ basically adjusted a feature in the game to do this, and it is what you call it the hit window. Okay, so, first, let me explain what the hit window is. The hit window, in caveman terms, is basically how long it takes to miss a note. If you want a more detailed explanation, then keep watching. If you want me to either explain how it affects the game and skip straight to the point, then skip to the timestamp shown on screen. So basically, the hit window is the amount of time that passes by after it goes past the grid before the note actually misses. If you have not noticed already, you can see that the notes can go past the grid, aka the playfield. There is a specific time in the game that is set to be that number in milliseconds that misses the note after that specific time. In our case, it is 33 milliseconds. Now, now that you know what the hit window is, I want to show what the new update does to the hit window and why it might competi right, might ruin competitive play. Well, almost. So, when the dev version of SoundSpace added a way to put in variable approach rate, the minimum capped approach rate was set to 10. There was a way to exploit the game by setting your approach rate to 10 and flailing your cursor and still hitting every note. The reason for this was because the hit window changes based on the fact that the approach rate changed. Lower AR equal to a bigger amount of time to hit the notes. Because the approach rate was set to 10, the milliseconds for the hit window was changed to around 165 milliseconds. Obviously, I bet you guys see the problem. And that is way too big for competitive play, and that will make the game extraordinary easily. Oh, and also, speed also changes approach rate, so that also plays a big part too. Tom and OCZ made his attempt to fix this by making the hit window stay the exact same regardless of approach rate and speed. Obviously, this conflicts with the fact that making your approach rate to 30 doesn't change anything anymore. The game is way harder for no reason. I DM'd Tom and OCZ about this and he tried to change the hit registration in response. Not the hit window, the hit reg. The hit reg is basically the hit box for every note. Tom and OCZ changed the hit rate so that it is dividing the, de the default hit reg by 0 0.6, which is the difference between 30 to 50, because he tried to fix it from going from 50 approach rate to 30 approach rate. I honestly wouldn't blame him for getting them mixed up, but that needs to be reverted ASAP. Now, what can Tom and OCZ do to, to fix this issue? So, first of all, he should start the hit window and hit rig from the current update. I'm going to be organizing this into a list so it is easier to understand. 1. This is completely optional. If you are going to listen to what I'm about to say on how to fix this, then just make the approach rate cap below 30. Otherwise, it is pointless to do so. 2. Make the hit window from 33 milliseconds to 55 milliseconds because 55 milliseconds is the hit window for 30 approach rate. 3. Make it so that the hit window is divided by the speed, because the speed also changes the approach rate, making the hit window higher in the current update. 4. That's basically it. Conclusion. This way, it is fair for competitive players, because everyone plays on 30 approach rate. The game might be a little bit easier, but this is what everyone is used to. Thank you guys for watching, and if Tom and OCZ is watching, thank you for listening to me. I hope this gets changed in the next update. See ya.